What's up guys? Um hope you guys been alright and just keeping yourself cool and just keep on putting in that work and thing alright guys um I wanna just talk to you guys about some stuff and basically it's gonna be like the naked truth. I don't know if I'm me alone got through them stuff here, but um I like being honest and so with you people and I sharing these things. Um, hopefully it will open somebody's eye and edify somebody so recently some a whole lot of stuff been happening even even with people close to me so let me ask you guys a question if you have a friend right that um that cuss you not bad cuss you but just saying that yo we miss you and cuss to be a part of your life because they miss you will you be upset at them or block them on whatsapp especially when you and that friend coming from so far all right here's the scenario guys now i think about it and be honest with me so the friend fly down i've known this friend for almost 10 years. The friend fly down. Um, I suppose they link the friend to help her move some stuff out of her apartment. So the next morning, get ready, wake up from 6 o'clock and just ready to prepare because I haven't seen my friend in so many years. You know? Calling the WhatsApp over and over, not getting through. So I like your Jano star, you know, um, Jano, I try and 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 I try, couldn't get to it, so I'm like, get vexed, I'm as a Jano star, see it on wicked, so I was a boom now, take off my clothes and cool and there my yard a chill, she messaged me and said something was wrong with the roaming. And stuff like that, I'm like, yeah, no. And then I think later on, there she 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 messaged me and said that, yo, she pissed. She sensed that I'm pissed. That I'm pissed. And I said, yeah, sure, I'm pissed. You know, um, who wouldn't be? You know what I mean? Y'all get up from six o'clock in the morning. I really want to see my friend. And. Expressing myself, say, yeah, I've been, I haven't seen you in so long, and I really want to say I was pissed at the phone, car wasn't going through, but at the same time, I was leave it to God. And then she went on to message me and say that, yo, it wasn't a, it wasn't a, um, a leisure, it was a business trip. But what I was trying to explain to my friend is this, yo, you see, even if I can see with my own two eyes, even though I'm there coming there to help you out business wise, it's comforting to me. Just like all the one of the disciples say, unless I see God with my own eye touch the wound in his hand and the piercing at his side, I will not believe. Me personally, and this person know who I stay, that I take my friendship very seriously. At times I like to make a phone call and check. If you are right. sometimes I don't want to make the phone call. I want to see you in person and see if you are right. Because that's the type of spirit that I have. But anyway, fast forwarding. After she sent me that message saying that, yo, um, it wasn't a leisure trip. It was just a, a, a business trip and she never had any interest in doing anything but just do her business and leave. You know that she blocked me. <laughs> and this is a friend that I know for a very long time, guys. I'm not covering up anything. I didn't have any intention at all. And this is a friend that I know. But anyway, moving on. I released that situation. Another situation been troubling me for a while also. Guys, is um 
easy. You guys ever love somebody that don't love you? Like, you know what I mean? At the end of the day, they tell you, it's like you give them everything and you, you had something and then in the midst of it, they said to you that they don't love you as much as you love them. And then, and then later on down, you hear a thing. You know what I mean? You, you, you hear a thing that, hey, guess what? You know? Or you find out, say, you're with somebody else. You know? And stuff like that. And I don't even know what to say, guys, because they, they say one thing that they're not ready to be in a relationship and they don't think that they have it to give to you and stuff like that. And then later on, don't you hear or find out that yo that they're with somebody else I'm not saying that I'm a saint but me that that you see it's things like these guys to be honest me not me not really trust women still because of them stuff there them little sneaky sneaky thing I don't want to go in no full detail guys because I don't want to call a person name or anything like that for privacy reasons and also respect but you know I, I, um, it's not the fact that they leave or say what they say only but it's what they do after that you know um, maybe it's me I love people too hard or love my friends too hard um, I have a next scenario too. Again, guys, we're a next friend I know way longer than the one before. This somebody that come on my house and eat at my, my, my table. <laughs> my mother knew her and stuff like that. Call her, WhatsApp, WhatsApp messaging, everything. Just delete me and just basically stop doing me as unfriend me. On Facebook, this is somebody who basically lived with me for a while. And I just really trying to cut the long story down short, guys. And yo, them stuff here are really, it really still affect me still. Why? Because I love people. But I thank God for the, the change and the pain, you know? You know? And I think. And I think one of the reasons why to, I hesitate relationship-wise going forward is because of a lot of these things that happened to me. So it made me kind of don't trust anymore. And then the type of spirit that I have, um, well, this is me still. If Maybe it's a stupid thought, but I'm, 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 it's just, for me, still, I'm going to learn from my mother what I see. It's reality that yo, know, if you ever take up a woman, you have to have your money. You know what I mean? And take good care and stuff like that. And yeah, man, make money. I don't really believe that I'm at a stage yet to take up something like a female full full time right right now. Especially since my last situation, I'm still kind of try to get wisdom through that. I mean, it's also my insecurity that insecurities that have me I'm also just just procrastinating and just itching regarding that and I think because of that what happened to I'm kind of afraid you know yeah. I'm kind of afraid I'm afraid for, for be honest because most they are focused on my dreams right now and I have a lot of work to do because I ain't reached nowhere yet <laughs> And then I worry if I gonna get distracted back again and then stuff there. But I want to, you know what I mean? But at the same time I like I looking at where I'm at in my life right now, the place where I'm at in my life now and wondering if it really makes sense for this divulge and going. But at the same time I'd like to. But also at the same time I don't I don't trust 
females anymore and stuff like that. It's just some little things. But I love them, but I don't trust her. I mean, for me, I just, it's two person I trust in my life. Right now, it's my mother and my nanny, who is the other lady that raised me. I've been, I've been in my, my mother's life from 1979 to now. You know what I mean? And third, yeah, sorry, to one more mommy <laughs> is Maki mother. I'm not, I'm not just no other woman. You know what I mean? No auntie, no sister, no cousin, no, no. I'm not, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, that's basically what I love everybody do. Um, a lot of people use me to, you know, and style me and this me and always sit down and just chill and take it, you know, guys. And my, my reason for that still because I have an excite to me, I really don't want nobody to see still. You know, it's not, it's not such a pretty side. You know, and I, I really want to leave that in the, in the past still. Guys, but um, yeah, that's where it is right now. Um, even another person that I even like now is still procrastinating back and forth. And I, when she do certain things, I kind of prayer. Or even any girl that do certain stuff, I pray them, I watch them for certain things, you know? Because, but man, I got you the same foolishness again, Team Sinus and just the madness here, you know? So that's where I'm at right now. I just really want to just enjoy my life now and just enjoy this new journey and just make some money and get that money up you know, as much as possible and get my own place, get my car and, you know what I mean, build up my thing. That's where I am right now and just get that creative juice flowing and get back that focus you know um yeah and just really just unwind guys but i just wanted to share um this with you guys um i let you guys know the naked truth and that is where i'm at right now so if you guys have any naked truth you'd like to share let's talk comment down below and be honest you know i mean just like i can be honest with you can be honest with me because I really believe, say, yo, we is a family and we is a team, you know what I mean? So, yeah, just thank you very much and my day is still is it. And remember, just continue to stay focused and remember that nothing can stop this case. God, I will rock. Whoop. Later.